11, a Winstead resident came home to a bear inside her kitchen. Another, Can you imagine? I know, and look at this bear outside the window here. Unreal. Another bear in Canton had to be euthanized after several breaking into several homes there. And with bear sightings on the rise across our state, Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Erin Edwards talked to the woman from Winstead after that encounter. That woman tells us she's used to seeing bears around her yard in Winstead, but this was the first time she came home to find one inside her house. Pulled up, didn't think anything out of the norm. My cat was sitting right here, like just sitting there staring at the window. Shannon Davis says it was the way her cat was acting that made her realize there might be something going on inside her home. It was just a weird look on the cat. Like I did, I, so I looked at the window, didn't even know the screen was out and I just saw a shadow like walk across the, the window. The shadow was from this guy who made his way through that window and into Shannon's kitchen. She took out her phone and got this video of him poking his head out. It was almost like, what's for dinner? <laughs> Shannon ran downstairs to grab her neighbor for help. He started banging on that door over there. The bear went in my room and climbed out my window. Crawl out the back window, figuring he was going to get out that way. You could, you know. So he decided to come back out. The bear ended up making its way out the back door. As for damage left behind, there wasn't much. There was a lollipop stuck to the rug. Um, it pulled out the snack tray. It was pulled to the edge, but there was only a yellow package of vanilla crackers, those vanilla wafers, and uh, the, um, those dots. That was it. The Department of Energy and Environmental Protection says the bear population has been steadily growing every year in the state. But this year, they've seen a 20% increase in their calls for bear issues. This is a pretty big increase for us. Just in Canton yesterday, a bear was euthanized after DEEP officials say it was attempting to break into homes. Four of its cubs were tranquilized. One did not recover from sedation. The biggest thing we want to get across to people is bears are attracted to food, so remove the food source and the bears don't have a reason to come into your yard, to come into your house. DEEP officials say if you see a bear around your house or in your neighborhood, you should call them. Reporting in Canton, Aaron Edwards, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.